Okay, today I wanted to show how we hooked up the limit switches on our PM25MV CNC mill conversion at uh, the Foxbuild Makerspace. So, the X axis is fairly straightforward. We have a limit switch here, which clicks either way. And then there's a ramp. If the table's moving left, it'll ride up the ramp, click the switch. The table's moving right, it goes over and hits the other ramp, also clicks the switch. If we look at Y, Kind of look down through here. We have a limit switch out front. The table moves out, click this one. And if it moves to the back, we end up, the table clicks that one. Um, we have covers for these, keep all the uh, chips out. Um, they're off now so that I can show how we did this. And then for Z, for the Z axis, when we did the conversion, we took the hand wheels out of here made a plate that fit in the hole, attached this aluminum angle, and at the top of the angle, we have our Z upper limit switch, and uh, that'll, that'll tell when we go, or attempt to go too high. We didn't put a limit switch on the lower end of Z because there's, uh, there's so many different places that it might make sense or not, um, but in general, the, uh, where your tool is is what you really care about, and uh, so we didn't do that. So that's basically how we did all our limit switches.